Yo. Yo. Who the chump? You you the chump. No, you the chump. No. Nope. Not Stum- today, chump. We'll see. Who's uh, gonna stump the chump? Chump. So you stumped. <laughs> and you chumped. <laughs> I'm not good at that talking smack. <laughs> I'm Adam Annis. And I'm Peter Martin. And you're listening to the You'll Hear podcast. And I am not a chump. Well, we'll see. I may it's be not, a chump. <laughs> Peter, it's really not in my nature to be much of a smack talker at all. It's, I know. I'm not good at it. Like, we sounded like, we sound like we're like in like prison. Guys from Bronx in prison is what we were kind of trying it's to funny. sound like. Yeah. Whenever I go I into that mode around Heather McCorkle, my yeah. better half, yeah. she just... Ru- like ruthlessly teases me about how silly it is. <laughs> how soft like, you sound. <laughs> yeah, it's just not in my nature. That's just not how it is. That's but right. uh, today we're playing a game. Yes. Playing a little listing game. This is a fun game you can play with any of your friends. Highly recommend it. It's called Downbeats Blindfold Test. <laughs> a little bit. <laughs> have you ever looked at one of those, seen one of those blindfold tests? I know. Where they get like none of them right. I yeah. feel like that's that's not fair. It's not fair. Yeah. It's a really hard thing to do, actually, is it to is do very a blindfold, hard. blindfold yeah. test. Especially if sometimes I feel like the journalists might not know the musicians. <laughs> yeah, influences. let's stump those chumps and see what happens. Yeah, like yeah. it's it's tough. So, yeah. but the rules for this stump the chump are that we have to pick pianists that we know the other person knows. Like right, I, we you like he not only knows like is pre- very familiar with very not just familiar knows with, and but we still have to try to stump them in that. Do you know that this is that pianist? Right. And we had a little bit of controversy already with the parameters of this so-called game. Yeah. Because you played a little bit of one of the ones you were going to do right before we started. Yeah. And I immediately blurted out who it was. And you were like, oh. And then I said, but still use that one. Because I've never heard that track before. Yeah, and you're like, no, you I'm not going to do it. You know who it is, yeah. I knew exactly who it was. Yeah, but why would we show them that? Because now well, <laughs> it's about stumping the chump. If I know that you know it, we should have waited until on, on, you were well, on camera. Matter. I didn't know it. I was just going to reenact that moment. That's okay. not what our listeners deserve, Peter. <laughs> Okay, so this is very authentic. Way more authentic than I was thinking. Right. Yeah, so we've got three each, right? Yeah. And we're going to, of course, we have not discussed this. And outside of that track, I haven't heard anything. You haven't heard any of these. But as you say, these are all pianists that, I, that my three are ones that I know you know these pianists. are Ones that you've studied, yeah. you've talked about. Likewise. And that you like. Likewise. So there's a little hint for you. Let's okay. Rochambeau to see who goes first. Ready? Okay. Ready? Wait, rock, paper, rock, scissors? Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Ready? Okay. Rock, One, paper, two, paper, scissors, shoot. shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Paper. Rock, paper, scissors, rock. Rock, paper, scissors, rock. Rock, paper, scissors, paper. Ah, got it. Okay. okay. Good. All right. Wait, isn't it? No, I get to pick who goes first. Oh, no. Sure. I go if you, well, you want to no, go no, last, I'll go you first. can go. Yeah. I'll go first. All right. All right. We're going to start out with a, well, I don't know if I'd say this is easy, uh, but we're going to start out with one. Are you ready? Yes. Adam, producer Caleb, are we ready? Yes. Yeah, he said yes. Stump the chump. Oh, wait, that's the wrong one. Hold You'll on. hear it. <laughs> I'm being stumped as a chump right now. So this Peter's computer is stumping him <laughs> as we speak. Here we go. All right. You okay? Yeah. It's an interesting psychology because I'm like, who would Peter pick for me? <laughs> I want to say Brad Mel, though. You are correct, yeah. sir. Yeah, yeah, that was very good. Good. Okay. Good. Yeah. This is Brad plays That's the Beatles' "Golden right Slumbers." It was, but it was something that I thought you might not have heard because it's relatively recent from his new re- recording. I've not heard it. Yeah, it's yeah. really good. The whole thing. All right, you ready for yours? Yes. <laughs> yes I can't call you chump yet because you haven't been stumped. But Can, I'm play, still a possible. Play a little chump. bit more of that new Brad record, actually, for the people before we move. I know. On. We just like Brad. Yeah, I know. Then just stop. Just play a little bit more. But couldn't that have been somebody imitating Brad? It sounds beautiful, by the way. What's that? It could have been somebody imitating Brad, but then that wouldn't have been part of our parameters. It would have been, yeah. I definitely would have had it by this point on that chord, just from the touch. It's a beautiful sound. It's a beautiful sound. Yeah. Yeah. What a great player. All right. Uh, Your turn. You ready? Yes. I see. You're going modern. I'm going. I'm going. Well, Well, some of this is kind of modern. Ready? Yeah. Here we go. Nope, we are not. 
This is very early in a player you love's career. Can I phone a friend? It's not fair because we just have this big locked hand melody. Let's just wait till the solo. Let's say the game doesn't start till you hear the solo, okay? Follow your friend. Okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> hey, um, can you help me out with this here? <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like someone that you've talked a lot about. Okay, wait, let me, let me, let me concentrate here. Win Kelly. Yes. Okay. So I wow. knew by the solo you would get that it. That was so... Okay, I never heard this. What is this? 1951. What? Yeah, I know. He must have been... I don't know when Winton Kelly was born. I'm ashamed that it took me that long, but that was... He was born in 1931, so he was 20 years old when he recorded this. Wow. This is an album uh, called Piano Interpretations. It's a Blue Note record from 1951. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's uh, Oscar Pettiford and... Mm. Uh, That's what I said. Oscar yeah, yeah. Pettiford. Yeah. Peterson. I meant Pettiford. You meant Pettiford <laughs> uh, and Lee Abrams. And it's actually, I was just flipping through this while we were yeah. setting this up. It sounds killer, man. I'm going to go listen yeah. to this today. I heard that record like probably at least 20 years ago. I don't remember it. And uh, wow, what a faux pas. You should I go, said Oscar I Peterson. might go check this out and do a video on this record because yeah. they're like a 20-year-old Wynton Kelly. Yeah. And you could hear like his influence in the beginning sounds like some other folks. Yeah. But by the time you get to that solo, his language is there yeah it's cool right good stuff good stuff okay you ready yeah the chump is about to try to that, i feel like this is like like when you play a horse you ever play a horse well neither one of us have stumped. i'm an h i don't want to be a hoe no no I'm we, a h. you are officially not stumped i, I feel oh, that's like right we, i got it yeah we get I, you know if you I, get it eventually it's okay. not like you don't get no guesses okay ready yeah I think I've seen this video before. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's it's from a, the seventies. It's from 1996. 1996. Hamburg. Yeah. Oh yeah, I have seen this. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. Solo wow. piano performance of, of course, Giant Steps. Yeah. I I'm thinking that I would have you know, problem. That's that was a tough one. No, no, no. That's that's fair. That's fair. I'm th I was thinking if I wasn't watching this and didn't know what it was, I might, I think I would have said McCoy. But it would have been a similar amount of time. I might have said chick for there was some chick. There's type some chick stuff. types of stuff. Yeah, that's the thing is all those guys at that age in the '90s, '80s, and '90s. It's harder to get their. I don't know. For me, it's harder to get their personalities. Except yeah. for Herbie. I don't know why I said Herbie first. I'm not sure. There was something about one of the lines where I was like Herbie. Yeah. Well, know. you're kind of an H like me. I'm just saying. You got it. <sighs> okay. <laughs> well, we're we, no, no one's totally experience, isn't it? <laughs> stumped yet, but we're not doing great. Okay. This is someone I know that you know well, and that is this you the love. third one? This is our second. second. My second. Okay, one, right. You went first. Uh, this is. Uh, I'll give you the the artist. The record is from. No, I'm not even going to no, do that. You're going to get it. All right. All I'm right. going to skip ahead to the piano solo. That's Sonny Rollins, I think. No, no it's not. Oh, no.
Is that Stan Getz? It is Stan Getz. Yes. Let's go. Let's back it back up to the solo. That was the whole solo. He's not. He's not. He was quite young on this and not heavily featured. But there's some clues. I can hear this. Is that McCoy? Nope. Oh, God. On that level. Oh, Herbie? Nope. Oh my God. There's Caleb, Caleb, more. edit this out. There's only one more. <laughs> Chicory. Yes. Oh my God. Why did I? <laughs> Caleb, please edit all this out. <laughs> oh my God. It's 1968. What the world's need. What the world needs now. Stan Getz plays Burt Backrack and Hal David. And I mean, that... now you know what's so silly about this. I totally. I mean, it's Chick. Of course, it's Chick. I wait, 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 wait. Confirmation bias. Wait, hold on, hold on. This is in times like these. Hold on, I might have just fucked this up. <laughs> Okay, that is Chick. <laughs> yeah, no, Chick totally plays half and Herbie plays half. <laughs> really? <laughs> but that was obviously Chick. Obviously. I love how like I I, mean, <laughs> I got Stan Gats before I got Stan Gats. Well, I did say study, but it's not I mean, like a, come on, Stan Gats is you hear four notes. I feel like I've studied Chick Corea, Herbie Hancock, and McCoy a little closer than I know. Stan Gats. All right, one more each. One more each. Come on, you got a flight to catch. Okay, this is this is this is now. I was gonna say this. Oh, Stump the chumps. This I thought would have been one of the harder ones, but uh, have we already done this person? No. <laughs> I know this recording too. No, I'd never heard this before. You might have heard another version of this. Ah. Uh. Yeah. I think a little clue would be to check out the left hand. Red Garland. Very yeah. good. Red yeah, Garland. yeah, yeah. Oh, it's so good. Yeah, so the left-hand clue is just the... Uh, yeah. Um, but also that language is so... It's almost... I mean, there's Winton Kelly-esque-ness to yes. it, for sure. Big but that, that left hand is the dead giveaway. Oh, it's so good, man. Very good. Woo! Okay, your last one. Oh, you I ready for this? Myself. If you Redemption. get this... You might get this, actually. It you should be the one this. that I got earlier. Why, why do I... I'm still salty about that. All right. Because I never heard that, so I was kind of proud of myself. But that's okay. Keith Jarrett. No. no. This is a very young version of this person as well. Shall we skip ahead to the solo a little bit? Yeah. How young this person is, this is amazing. Thank you. 
Nothing? Nothing. You're giving up officially? I'm giving up. I'm the chump. This is a 24-year-old Kenny Kirkland in 1979 with Miroslav on an e- ECM record, First Meeting. Yeah. Very I've never heard this, but it's... Oh, yeah. But now that you can hear it, right? Yeah. Oh, I'm <laughs> oh, look sorry. Look at how much it hurts him. It hurts him I'm physically. <laughs> this one actually... I'm... I'm sorry, I haven't heard this record. I'm excited though, dude. But thinking about it, like that, that that's very hard to. Yeah. So obviously, Herbie. I would have said Herbie, but yeah. you were like a very young, and I was like, well, this is not a very young Herbie. Recording. I could tell. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, and I actually was even thinking Miroslav. I was like, that sounds like. It sounds like Miroslav. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Again, why would I be able to? Say, but I was like, Kenny Kirkle wasn't even on my radar. So damn, it should have been. We stumped him. Stumped him. Stumped the chump. A big chump. A big chump. <laughs> so. Well, this is fun. We might not be able to use that last one because it is an ECM record. Oh, so we can't. We'll so we got to redo this episode. We'll see how Good. it goes on YouTube. <laughs> if you're just now tuning in and there was just a load of silence, it's because <laughs> right. we played an ECM record. That's and, right. And there. Until next time. <laughs> you'll hear it. <laughs> I was going to say stop a little bit.